Doc Larry! Doc Larry! Show me latest papers. Otherwise you cannot go through here. I know the drill. The drill has changed. Too many forgeries. All Ogs must now carry a supplementary permit authentication card. Do you have this card? I'll clear it up with the people I work for. They'll take care of it. And who do you work for exactly? Does it matter? You worried I might outrank you? <laughs> of course not. These rules, they apply to everyone. Besides, I am regional director of, uh, of uh, document checking. I report to God directly. It is God who tells me that if you continue this way, without proper permit, I am morally obliged to shoot you. Is that right? My friend, I know what you're thinking. It's terrible the way they make laws against your kind. But listen, maybe I can do something to help. We could come to an understanding. What kind of understanding? Lucky for you, I know a guy. An expert in... Uh, permitification. A document agent. He offers permits, authentication cards. Peace of mind. With his help, you go wherever you want, whenever you want. No more hassles. What do you say? This document agent you mentioned, you see the one in charge? He gets you to stop Ogs and offer them this opportunity to do business with him. Go see for yourself. My friend has documents to pass checkpoints, to keep police off your back, to get into parts of Prague you never knew existed. Tell him Drahumir sent you. You'll see. I give you address, yes? All right, give me the address. I think I'd like to see who's behind all this. Shekashka. There is a courtyard behind the apartment building. Very easy to find. My friend will be there. He will get you latest permit card. Just pay him and don't ask questions. I was stopped by someone named Drahomir at a checkpoint. He sent me here. Apparently you help Ogs with documentation, upgrade their permits. You have the money. Maybe. You want to tell me what I'm paying for exactly? You pay to get your name on the list. Melina upstairs, she works on your shiny new permit. You come back in one week to pick it up. Standard pickup fee will apply. How much do you charge people for this? Not people. Augs. 35,000 credits. You're not even trying, are you? You just blatantly scam Ogs out of as much as you can. You want updated permit or not? Documents are actually pretty good. You'll see. Trust me. The girl is very talented. These documents, what are they? Stolen? Forged? Invisible? Look. Just give me what you have, and I'll put your name on the list. That's how it works. Melina does surprisingly good work. Puts more effort in than we ask her to. This is as much as I'm willing to give you. So what kind of shiny new permit does this get me? Fucking tourist. You're wasting my time, Og. Please, don't shoot me. You want to tell me what's going on here? Arts and crafts? I think you work for those scam artists out there. Or do they work for you? It was never meant to be a scam. More like uh, social services for the disaffected. You know, like no og left behind. Looks like a forgery ring to me. I hate the word forgery. I prefer graphic arts activism. I, I help people to, to be other people. 
and seriously try getting anywhere with forgery on your resume. You're involved in something that takes advantage of people, and you're worried about your resume? Is that, that may have come out wrong. I mean, yes, career is important, but it's not everything. I know that. I, t I tend to get really nervous when I'm stressed. I, I mean, I, I'm stressed when... Which always just makes things worse. Oh, okay, look. I have no reason to be nervous here, do I? You're totally on my side, right? One of the good guys. Not like Dravomir. I'm not here to make you nervous. I just need you to explain it to me. The essentials of what's been going on here. Essentials. Right. Essentially, I was trying to help my augmented friends. The way I saw it out there, the promise of fake documents was being used to extort people. How does that help them? The extortion part sucks. I swear to you, I'm totally anti-extortion. Obviously. Let me explain better. The government, they print up these official permits each month. But they only sell them to the rich corporate and military allies. Meanwhile, the other orgs, they get kettled out of the city because their documents aren't up to date enough. That's what was happening to my friends. Government corruption versus organized crime. And regular people get caught in the middle. You gotta love the classics. When it was just me, I didn't charge anyone. But then Drahomir shows up and turns it into this big operation with fake checkpoints and ridiculous fees. I didn't want anything to do with that. I wanted to stop. Why didn't you? I was scared. Drahomir said he would kill me. Looked at me kind of... like you're looking at me now. You're not going to kill me, are you? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. Look, the real problem is Drahomir and that checkpoint of his. Without him in the picture, the rest of them couldn't run a lemonade stand. Maybe you could... You know. You think I just walk around shooting people? Don't you? I like knowing there are other options. Okay, so stab him. Scare him, or get the police to do their job for once. I remember Drahomir mentioning this cop who threatened him. She was hanging around his checkpoint. Who knows? Maybe there really is one good cop in Prague. That sounds like the safest bet. Otherwise, you're asking me to pick a fight with a bunch of guys in uniforms, scam artists or not. The whole city would come down on you. Still, up to you how you want to handle it. Right. And just so we're clear, you are going to stop forging documents now. I don't like getting into trouble. And even worse is other people suffering because of me. No more faking documents ever again. Unless someone really, really needed one. Then I'd probably do it. I mean, if we knew for a fact that we could help someone, we should do whatever we can, right? It depends what you have in mind. The docs I make, they really can fool the authorities. Sort of. Sort of? Drachomir flooded the streets with forgeries. So the city started tracking more, adding scanners, validation numbers. Now, unless one of my permits gets activated in the city database, it's just plastic. So you're telling me these people pay for forgeries and then probably get deported anyway? It doesn't have to be that way. I have two permits that I literally just made. And I think we can really help these people. If you're willing. Alright, how do we help? Their names are Edward Broad and Irenka Bauer. Drachomir was going to charge them like 20 more times. But maybe you could just give them the forgeries? Early Christmas present? You said it's just plastic that people get deported anyway. How does this help them? I think I know how to get them activated. As long as you're willing to follow through. Alright. I'll go meet Edward and Irenka. In the meantime, are you going to be okay here? Once they learn that Drahomir's been taken care of, the others will leave me alone. 
He's the one I'm scared of. By the way, there is a safe over there where they keep their money. I'll give you the code. 2489. Feel free to help yourself. What about you? Way ahead of you. We were machines, sir. But terror and pain have turned us into souls. There is something struggling within. Moments when something enters into us. Thoughts come upon us which are not of us. We feel what we did not used to feel. We hear voices teach us to have children so that we may love them. Primus, is that you? Are you a Renka Bauer? Who are you? Please, take whatever you want. Just leave us alone. I didn't come here to take anything. You haven't? Irenka, she gets very scared. Whatever you've come to tell her, you should first tell me. I... I am the robot Helena. Irenka's not well. We must shield her. Irenka paid someone to make her an AUG permit. To keep her from being taken to Gollum City. That someone wants to come through. Really? If, if that's true, she'll be... We'll be very happy. If we can stay in Prague, maybe they'll even... There was once a great play that predicted so much. Robots, revolutions, the future of mankind. She memorized all of it. It's her way. It's my way of trying to understand. I'll take your word for it. Here. This permit is good enough to fool anyone who takes a look at it. Does... Does this mean I don't have to hide anymore? It's not that simple. You're still in danger. The permit needs to be activated. Otherwise, a routine scan will mark you for Gollum just the same. Uh, I don't understand. I'm sorry. There's no legal way for you to stay here. You should prepare for the worst. Uh, I... Uh, we don't know how to prepare. I'll take care of the activation. Just keep a low profile until I can get it sorted out. Thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you. I... I didn't know what to do. There are not many people a man like me can call on for help. What do they want? What everybody wants. Money. To feel strong. At first I thought they were here to take me away. Any moment now, they will take me away. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Don't get an old man's hopes up. Unless... My daughter? Did she send you? She did, didn't she? Why else would you? Please, tell me. When can I see them? Why would your daughter send me? I thought maybe... Maybe she and the little one finally decided to... To help Grandpa with his permit situation. But... She probably understands that I need to avoid detection. It is better not to make contact. When was the last time you saw them? A few years. Since the day of the... You know... The day of the incident? The time I ran naked onto a football field as a teenager, that was an incident. This... This was the work of the devil. He closed our eyes, forced us to see what he sees. That's a long time not to see someone you care about. It's not their fault. My son-in-law, he... He keeps them away from me because... Well, because... Because why? What am I, on trial? Soon you'll be judging me just like he did. Like they all did. Judging you for what, Edward? They say I became a monster. In the park. It was during the incident. You were with your family when the signal went out. Darrow's broadcast. It caused all those Augs to lose control. I grabbed the youngest by the wrists. We were spinning. We spun like mad. I don't know where it came from. This exhilaration that wasn't mine. It was reckless, I admit. There were mosquitoes in my brain. There was blood. They say that I... It couldn't have been me. 
Someone else must have... A stranger, after I blacked out. Please, tell me you believe me. Tell me it isn't possible that... I did that to him. When the signal was broadcast, Augs everywhere were made to do terrible things. Things they would never have done otherwise. Some of them can't remember, or choose not to be able to remember. The truth is, yes, it's possible, Edward. But that doesn't necessarily make you responsible. It was out of our control. I said, I, I tried to tell them. Whatever my hands may have done, my heart did not. But what kind of defense is that? If I can't forgive myself, why should they? One of them is still alive, and whether I ever get to see him or not, I want to remain as close as I can. I want to remain in Prague. Here, this permit should fool anyone at a glance. I remember the officer saying I would have to pay again. Is that true? No, I'm not here to collect. I'm here to help. I appreciate that. So, what now? Do I have to activate something? I can put on my nice coat if necessary. If I have to wait in line, I'll wait in line. I don't complain. The situation's a little less legal than that. Oh. Do you need me to break in somewhere? I'll take care of it. Just try to keep a low profile until I figure out how to validate your number. All right. I can do that. I will wait here. Milena, I met with both those Augs you made permits for. Now what? There's a computer at the government kiosk that handles the Augment Permit Registry. You'll have to... access it. Quote, unquote. You mean break in? The code to the server room is 6788. Be careful, there may be other forms of security. Alright, I got it. No, sorry. Not from here, are you? What gives it away? You just walked up to a police officer. And I have this funny feeling you expect something good to come out of it. I recently got stopped at a fake checkpoint. Heard there was a cop around here who might know what I'm talking about. Draumir, he's a slippery fuck. Pays off all the right people, provides all these bullshit documents that prove he's legit. Regional inspector, my ass. I'm putting a file together. A file? This guy's dressing up like a cop and harassing hogs in the street. <laughs> Sounds like 90% of the people I work with. Listen. The right amount of coin in the right kind of pocket, fancy looking paperwork, those things go a long way in this city. Especially if the perception is that he's not really doing anything wrong. Just giving Ogs a hard time. There's more to it than that. That's exactly what I think. Why don't you fill me in? What's Drahomir been up to behind my back? Dramir's checkpoint is the setup for a forgery ring. He's not just stopping Augs and giving them a hard time. He's not just taking people's lunch money. It's extortion. This forgery ring, you have an address? I was inside. I saw the equipment. You know what? You had me back at harassing. I've been dying for an excuse. A chance to go after someone who actually deserves it for once. No more hiding behind the people he bribes. I suggest keeping your distance. Official police business now. Stay out of it. Time to shut it down, Drahomir! Time to shoot 
I've seen Drachovir pretend to be many things. My friend was never one of them. It's been taken care of. He's not gonna be a problem anymore. Thank God. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad you did. Listen, if you ever need documents for something... I'll be fine. Thanks. Milena, I got into the art permit registry. Hold on. That should give me access now as well. Why am I seeing a security timer? Probably because neither of us have done this before. Cross your fingers. I borrowed this employee ID from a guy in a bar. Why does it say there's only one validation slot? Shit, shit, shit! The city has quotas for this kind of thing. Prague is designed to regulate people to death. What does that mean? The system won't let this guy register two people. Just scan something. There isn't much time. Help one person at least. Good. Edward's documents should hold up to any kind of scanning check now. He's as legit as he can be. Without actually being legit. I came here to help two people. It doesn't always work that way. Look, you need to get out of there. Please. Malena, that permit I wasn't able to scan. What happens to Irenka now? She probably ends up in Golem. Or she gets arrested for trying to use fake documentation. Thrown into a cell somewhere. I don't know. Doesn't exactly feel like a win, does it? No, it doesn't. We did the best we could. Listen, thanks for being one of the good guys. Jensen! My favorite techno wonder kind! Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? They're not gonna be a problem anymore. What do they want? You behind on your protection money? I... I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. You know how it is with these gangster types. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. The Valley internal politics. I... I'm gonna get it sorted. Gonna see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down, the day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. You know, I've always wanted to get a closer look at those sari fogs of yours. A real close look. So, uh... So let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then... Well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Uh, feel my way around. Hang on a sec, you're gonna put me under for how long? What if the Diwali send reinforcements? Oh, you're just stalling. Those illiterates aren't going to get in here. Don't be scared of the chair, okay? The chair is gentle. I promise. This thing with the Diwali is nothing. Otar's pissing where he shouldn't. I count on you to fix me, Kohler. To some extent, your problems are my problems. That's sweet, Jensen. Otar Botkoveli is the Diwali number two guy. The men outside, they were his men. But the big boss man is Radic Nikolatse. He is the number one guy. And I know Radic, so... So don't worry about it. Now, are we gonna do this procedure, or what? What exactly are you gonna do to me? I'm not sure yet. First, I gotta get in there to see what's wrong. But don't worry. I'm not gonna do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. I promise. Besides, you've been here a few times. You know I'm professional. 
You've never had to put me under before. I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. Kaboom! Now, you want me to fix you or not? All right. Let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. It's... it's gonna be fine. You... you won't even know I'm in there. You'll feel weightless, far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it. I swear I didn't mean to... Your retinal display should be back soon. You can still move, right? Where, where did you... I was... I was trying to connect the unconnected. But you got some strange fucking ogs back there. I, I mean, I, I probably shouldn't have... Uh, here, let me get you some water. Or something stronger, maybe? Water. You got it, Jensen. Just, uh... Just ease out. Okay, don't freak out. Rebooting was the only way to save you. Save me from what, Color? Core meltdown. You almost melted my chair. So I reset you, and I found these... these, uh... I think it's better if I show you what I found. Bring up your system display. You need to see this for yourself. These are your implants. You're familiar with all these, right? Yeah. David Seraph installed them. Took two years for my body to get used to everything. Right. Well, I had to undo some of that getting used to. What's going on, Kohler? Why do I feel different? Something was trying to vampire the juice out of you. I couldn't figure out what until after the reboot. Turns out your Factory Zero is not the standard Factory Zero. What am I looking at? Experimental fucking test dogs, man. Hidden inside your body. You're telling me I got more implants than I thought I did? More than your body can handle. Pretty cool, right? I'm not sure yet. I want to show you what happens when you activate one of these suckers. See that? Major spike in your power consumption! Where the hell did these things come from? I can't answer that. All I know is the explosion must have woken them up. But man, you want to use these crazy fucking things? That's your right. We just gotta make sure it doesn't fry you. Now, I think I maybe got an idea on how to do that. Try shutting down one of your other implants. You know, just for fun. Go see that? Cooled you right down. You have the power to balance your system if you want. Just, you know, don't activate everything all at once. What would happen if I did? Well, you'd suffer some major glitches due to overheating. We're talking risk of permanent damage. So, you know, maybe don't do that. All right. Reset me now, Kohler. I'll reactivate what I need myself. Okay. So I'm not always gonna be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. I thought you were supposed to be my AUG expert. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man! I'm pretty sure they're not from Mars. I just... I feel bad. You deserve answers I can't give you. I can help manage your system better than anyone in Prague. I help you make the most of the new augs we just found. But you can't tell me where the hell they came from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my augs. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris' work. These new augs, they... They look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? 
Seriously, if you talk to Sarif, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. You ever seen anything like this before? An AUG system that's deliberately hidden like that? I don't know, Jensen. I mean, I heard of people getting the black market treatment before. Pass out in Prague, wake up in Shanghai. But usually they wake up with less AUGs, not more. What exactly makes these AUGs so different from my other ones? They look like experiments, is what? Loose wiring everywhere, man. It's, it's like half of you is uh, untested, unfinished, unbelievable. It's... it's beautiful is what it is. Why would Seraph have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. I am not convinced this is a Seraph job. The tech itself is super high-end, but the PDOT insulation, sloppy. The bone mounting mounted on the quick. Just doesn't have Sarif's touch. Looks more like a retrofit to me. Something much more recent. Well, what are you thinking? I'm thinking how much I hate being unconscious. You said these additions look recent. How recent? Within the last two years, give or take. Something happened to you in that time? I was pulled out of the ocean and put in some facility in Alaska to recover. There was a few months there that... The more I try to remember, the blurrier it gets. Shit, Jensen. That's terrifying. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's wrap this up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Praxis solves everything. Keeps customers happy. Just uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's gonna be a balancing act for you. Well, unless... Unless what, Kohler? There could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. A neuroplasticity calibrator. There's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise. I want to know about it. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? But... My last shipment got intercepted... by Otar Botkoveli. The same Otar whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. If that sounds like something that interests you, then you should know that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard off Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Kohler. Thanks for the praxis.